That's it? That's all you got? Just three little teasers? What does that even explain to me? <laughs> Get over here! What was that? What, what is going on? What, what, what is this N7 day anymore, folks? What, like, what is this? What's going on over there in Bioware? I, I just, I, I just can't even do it right now. I just can't even do it. Hello, welcome to the latest installment of Nico Legend. I'm here to talk about how N7 was just just a disaster, boring. There's how can you be excited about something where they showed really nothing about really anything and you know I, I just I'm just kinda done. I'm just kinda just letting you know I'm just done. That's the end of the video. Bye. Are you serious? If you see my reaction on that, you kind of get the idea where I'm coming from. I, I, I can't be the only one that's feeling like this. And if you're with me and you understand, great. If you're not with me, that's fine as well. I'm just going to you know pray that we can get some common ground going on here. So just hold your pitchforks back until I'm finished, and then you can stab me in the ass. So uh, before we get started, hey, you like what you see today, feel free to subscribe to the YouTube channel. Appreciate it. Okay, so let's get started. Wow. I knew I named this stream the right fucking name. This is such a disaster pile of shit. Jesus Christ, man. That is just... Why is Mike Gamble the PR guy? This, this guy should not be writing fucking suicide notes for his franchise. <laughs> That's what this is. It's, it's a fucking suicide note. So I, I decided to bring up this article because um, it's relevant to what I'm pretty much talking about. And I was going to do this video earlier, but I, you know, before this article came out, uh, before someone had the same uh, idea that I did, um, I, I just, the point is, is, I'm just so bored of N7 Day these days. There's just nothing great and concrete that's come out to where I can be like, ooh, wow, look at this. I mean, if you really, let me ask you this. You really think if, did you truly enjoy that teaser that they showed at the recent N7, uh, N7 Day? Please. Please answer honestly down in the comments below if you really if you thought that was worth the wait. When you go back to compare the the first original teaser, which actually showed a lot back in 2020 of the Game Awards, that actually showed stuff. That was that was great. I had great reaction to that. I was all hyped. I talked all about it on the YouTube channel. But when you see my reaction like this, oh the audacity! Oh Jesus Christ! Uh, I put my headphones on for that shit. Oh my fucking god, it's so stupid. You know, it just it just makes me wonder. It's like, why, why did I even waste my time? I really did waste my time. I Honestly, folks, if you're one of those people out there that are saying, like, this is insane footage we saw, or this is blah, amazing and all that, I don't know what derangement syndrome you got. But, and I'm not trying to be insulting, it's just, wow. Like, how can you be excited for something that shows absolutely nothing? And this is pretty much it. This is my reference here. Uh, it's just so boring. I wish... Now, hear me out on this. I wish Bioware would just not show anything for a while. Okay? I wish they wouldn't even celebrate N7 Day. Because besides these crappy teasers, they were just showing new merchandising in a crappy blog post. I mean, I just... Like, what's the point? Like, what's the point, you know? Just, I don't know. That's just me. I, I just don't think that's very good marketing, in my opinion. Like, yeah, we get it. You know, we know that the game's alive. You said it multiple times throughout the past few years and maybe beyond that. Casey Hudson said it before. You know, we've gotten pictures now, trailers, and this and that. Although I always think the definitive trailer was, the definitive teaser of anything next Mass Effect related was that 2020 teaser trailer. That was great. That was awesome. I got super hyped for that. And why am I in the background there? Um, you can dissect that teaser trailer all you want, but there's really nothing. There is nothing. Nothing. 
That is just smoke and mirrors. That is just a distraction because these guys really don't have anything definitive to offer us. I, You guys got to stop being fooled by that shit. It, like AAA gaming, marketing, like it, they, they don't even have to try anymore to fool you people. They don't even have to try. And we've seen it dozens of times and billions of apology letters to prove it. Mass Effect might be under that same boat when it comes out. God, I hope not. Trust me, I don't want this game to fail. I don't want Dra uh, Dragon Age Dreadwolf to fail. But this is Bioware. They're on. They're in Strike Central right now. They're not doing so well as a company. They lay off a bazillion different employees and all this crap. People leaving, going. It's been like that with Bioware since fuck. I don't know. Dragon Age Inquisition or even further than that. I just, I just can't even. I can't even do it anymore. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The big reveal is Andromeda distress signal detected. All right. What do you guys think? I, there's really not much I could really talk about, and you can always argue this was a waste of everybody's time. Well, imagine how I felt with checking out at seven day stuff. Um, but I just don't think they should be doing this. I don't think they should be doing yearly teases or anything unless they have something concrete. Sorry about the clipping. Something to where I can just be like, holy shit. That's got this story element. That's got this canon element. Holy crap, this character's coming back. Like the first teaser trailer. I can't fucking stress it enough. Everything else past that, it's just like, I just don't care. I don't care about an image. I don't care about a figure walking around in a coat when I can't even see her face. Like, this is a step backwards, my opinion. I'm rambling, I know. Bear with me. I'll be done in a second. To be honest, if you compare this teaser to the first teaser, it's a night and day difference. I actually got to see what things were going on, dialogue, where it's going to possibly take place, the characters that are in it, the planet, remnants of Reaper tech. What did this show? Th this this skewed figure, this private figure, no face, a stupid coat, no dis dis uh, discernible uh, tr figure traits of who, who, which character this could be, nothing. Just a uh, guy came and see the face or anything. It's Why are you hiding so much? when you're sh already showing so little. If you showed us a face or some dialogue, that's different. But you're just walking down a fucking hallway on a five second clip. It, it, it's a total of like how, like an, a minute, 30 seconds or something. It was so, so not worth any of that weight. It was terrible. Anyway, it, it just, and uh, yeah, I just, let me just, reaction, reminder. That's it? That's all you got? Just three little teasers? What does that even explain to me? So yeah, now you, now you definitely remember. Okay, folks, well, I'm just going to get out of here before I ruin anybody else's day. But let me know down in the comments below what you think about the N7 day that happened in Mass Effect in general. I can't help but articulate. I'm, I'm tentative towards doing anything else Mass Effect related until there's actually something concrete. So I just, I, I just thought I'd do a short version of what I did for the stream before because, oh my god, this was terrible. Anyway, folks, I've been your host, Sneak Little Legend, and nobody cares. But hey, if you did, thanks a lot. And I hope to see you on the next one, Pathfinders. And uh, you may s commence the pitchfork stabbing. Oh, no. <laughs> they look fucking stupid. Is that really it? Oh my god.